Ano yung unsa ang kalahian sa subanan? So it's mainly from I I I do not so at my own place it's not quite the truth. We may be the leader and we need to try to understand what has been how the conversation will revolve around what can we do differently as civil society actors. Each of us have different strengths. How can we leverage on each other's strengths? How can we support each other? to work more effectively. Women of indigenous communities face in the country's workshop provides an opportunity to know the research findings on what are the gender concerns in mining in the lower Mekong region. That means Laos, Vietnam and Cambodia. And this research is a culmination of tireless efforts since past one, one and a half year. And this workshop provides an opportunity to Discuss them. Wherever there's a small mining company, such as the Junior, such as the Nine or so mining companies that we mentioned, I think in the case of, of um, uh, Cambodia, um, always look and see if behind them there are the big companies like BHP, Billy Tom, Rio the, the perspective that I tried to, to speak to was that of the global mining industry and the extent to which it has chosen this region, the Lower Mekong region, targeted this region in terms of future mines, markets, and, and so on. <laughs> ទីមួយមួយជាវិស័យនៅប្រទេសកម្ពុជាហើយតែយើងបានធ្វើការ <laughs> In Burma, it has been shut out. The country has been shut out for many decades, and the people in Burma are still, still uh, very afraid to speak out. Uh, this is a very rich experience workshop. Like uh, I, uh, I can learn uh, from the experience, yeah, their first-hand experience, how they tackle uh, the many issue in their uh, in the country. Also, uh, focuses on the women, on the gender. So it is very interesting, and it's. it's this is very helpful and informative for me to also address. And there's also the EIA process that is not done properly, maybe a proper guide. Mining sector, mining activity is uh, growing and growing in Southeast Asia. Uh, and the impact is very serious. And of course, we all were all, all way know that women are who are the most vulnerable in many especially in environmental impact, uh, health impact, social impact. I think looking uh, women, looking gender in the mining sector is necessary, very important for development for the world.